let us list four things that even as I'm going to lead you in prayer now these are the signals, the symptoms of a man that the presence of God has. now but the Philistines took him put out his eyes so the first thing that the devil does to a man they capture is to do what? a, a weapon immediately visions your sight go you can't see loss of vision is a sign of a backsliding spirit loss of vision loss of sight so when somebody comes and tells you i used to see before i don't see again i used to hear before i don't hear again it's as if heaven has closed i can't make contact i can't even touch god in my spirit it's a first is a layer of backsliding you need to be rescued quick vision they removed his eyes they take away his eyes immediately because so yeah let me let's see how you see us again so loss of sight vision many of you as we pray now you will cry you will cry that god will restore your eyes i know there are people here there were brothers sisters here you used to see in the night many of you you peep into the things of angels angels when i walk up you peep into what they do when i say something must have happened I remember when I prayed for what it used to I used to consistently pray for what it God every night God would jack me up and take me to a junction in order. That was when I knew the junctions that have an altar in them. I saw warehouse. I can mention six places I saw in my dream. I would say, Lord, why am I here? Yes, someone here, no here, no here, no here. But in as giving as here, something in like. It means that God cannot, you are no longer useful. Number two, they brought him down. Somebody say, bring down. It was the God, the capital of Philistines, Gaza. Bringing down. Sometimes so many people have been brought down from their high horse of prayer. Oh, many people here in America. All your shirts now sweating. They have been brought down. Are you here? You have been brought down. You have been brought down from consecration. Brought down from your height of prayer brought down. Sometimes when I pray in my room and my voice is ringing into the spirit, I would know. Because when I send a decree in my room, I would know that that night, which is done also. Maybe I make it one night by 4 a.m. Camp Potra in the morning. My neighbors were peeping from the window. How am I a Christian? How am I that night? They that left. Handling any room from window. Because that day, my voice was sounding like seven voices at the same night. He got no kwatiya kwailiku pieces. In the morning, that was the day my neighbors began to greet me like a sad. They say, Good morning, sir. I'll say, Good, good morning, sir. I'm about to pay my car. Good morning, sir. I guess it's chini. I'm on your bond again. I'm on your new year. I kept to wake up something inside of you. There's an anointing I have. That anointing provokes gifts. You cannot stay ordinary. That's why I say, bring the naked people. Let them come. Mark wash your Bible. Have hey tea yipo agwa. Chosi a kuto agwa ngoda. You think that the devil did not tempt me? When this Arusian women work started, it was not to six months. Some women began to send me SMS. They would say, you gave us appointment in such and such hotel. What's that? Your room number? I'm coming. Me. You know what they were doing? The devil was trying to check to know the kind of spirit I have, whether I do I touch women. So they would so eh, I will go and check. I will say, What's your name? She will send her name. I will take the name to Facebook. Asa. I never know her. So I say, How did you get my number? Yeah, block come. Six ladies did it in order. As if I send it, I send it. Maybe somebody send it. Maybe they wanted to the devil wanted to check my arrow near my cam guard. Or man on that side, that watch me, I watch. Something died in me some years ago. He with there now, he can't really appeal to me. On one last some time ago, when we chineke jishama, chum, cookie there, cookie there, coach has started. Say, you cannot preach this message if you have this thing in your heart. So when I was in front of him, we were married to a marketing or here. Before I married, he moved over to the upstairs building. Come on, we married to about this pharmacy. A lady came out from that pharmacy. Her friend was still inside. As she came out, and my eyes saw her through the glasses through her eyes she began to beg me that i should deliver her. i could see her inside begging me but outside she was dressed like a harlot with nails but through her eyelids i saw that so immediately i wanted to open the door and go out because i wanted to confront her outside marriage and say shake my hand 
I wanted to help her. Her friend came out. That was what broke that thing. So I can even see. It was so raw. When I look at you, I can see. The spirit said, was saying, can you help me? I'm bound inside here. I am bound. I want to help myself. I can't come out. Young man, what are you living for? What do you live for? How much alarm? I don't have to give back to you. I have two, four lovely kids. And I say, ma'am, my energy now is given to the place of prayer. I don't have what I'm living for again. My sleep. When I wake up, I pray again. I don't have what I'm living for. You, what are you living for? How copanya immediately and brought him down. Are there young men here? You have been brought down. He man in the baby before, but the energy to the energy to bounce back to where you were before has been lost. You used to do three hours easily. How come three hours is now a struggle? I want to lag it. I want to lag it. How come three hours that I used to do sometimes even three hours to you was chicken change? As you move around in your parlor, you bask. You bask, Kai. You bask. You know you are basking. Apostle Aaron may pray to the point he said that by 4 p.m. in the afternoon, he used to hear when women gather in heaven, angel, they, as they are pouring water, she hears their song. That if he was a musician, he would have written many songs. That they used to meet by 4 p.m. Angels would come by the water side, pour water and begin to sing. Hey. And when a drink that is drinking day, but today every day at Achogande, the sister Achoga came through and away baru brought him down. And after bringing him down, see the third layer. The third layer is that they bound him. The devil, after he brings you down, he brings addictions into your life. The third layer is to bind you with addictions. Suddenly you discover that you can't control watching pornography. Suddenly, when a woman goes, you are looking at the laps. It is binding. The the first one, what go down here? Second one, bring him down. Third one, a case here, a case here. You notice you're not a struggle. Only him knows. Some pastors are even struggling. They don't know how to tell anybody. A man of God. I think it was in Lagos. Every day, God was telling him, repent, repent. Leave women alone. Repent. He didn't want to. God now warning that the next time he does it, he'll be embarrassed in national TV. He was wondering how it was going to happen. Until one day, national TV, he was doing deliverance. Yes, he lose. Because he lose. The lady had by kiss here on national TV. Protocol now does it the lady lady and one like this. A people are me put the nonsense. TV camera, trust camera people. Go on later. Hey, put the TV. Neta. Chineke me say ya. Pa 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 pa. TikTok, Instagram, Facebook. I see Bishop so and so kissing in the church. Yeah, me chapel that's all mistake. Which kind of mistake? TV a brule. in public. Don't do it in secret. Clean up your mess. Tell that lady boldly. Be bold. Send her a message tonight. Tell her that I want to give me rubbish. I found Jesus. I can't do it again. Let it go. Delete her. Delete everything that remembers I remind you of her. Pictures. Block her. Facebook. If I tell you, go to my Facebook page. I blocked many on my Facebook page. Block one time bound him with fetters and guess what he now did grind in the prison house it means that the devil gave him a different occupation somebody that was supposed to be a deliverer any a different agenda but i have an assurance tonight that will make us pray show me the next verse oh i feel the anointing of god kai something is searching inside of me you know when I preach to this level, that's when that's how power flow. You see, my eyes are open now. I'm seeing things. I like this dimension. That's when I flow easily. Go to the next verse. How be it? Somebody say, How be it? The hair of his head began to grow again. Now, let me tell you the work of the quiver. In the quiver, God cools you down. And gives you time for your head to grow again. Now you can lose an anointing instantly, 
but in regrowing it, it's going to be a process. That's why the Bible says it began. Anytime you're going to be restored, your restoration will always be a process. It, it, anointing can live instantly, but for you to recover it, it's going to be a process. The Bible said, how be it? The air began. Many of you want to bounce back immediately. You can't bounce back immediately. You need a process to cool off in the, in the quiver where God reconstructs you. The quiver is a place of strength. The quiver is a place of reconstruction. The quiver is a place of, oh my God. He began to grow. Somebody here, because of this week of being in the quiver, Somebody begin to pray in the Holy Ghost now. I will soon call up the guest minister. But I, I, I need her to come under this ordination now. Shile. The Lord gave me a message for the youth of my generation. I will take it to the ends of the earth. Shile. The devil sought me to destroy my life. Some of you may not know what I went through. But I hear Paul, Ephesians 6 10. He said, Finally, finally. Is there somebody hearing the admonition of Paul? He said, Finally, finally, my brethren, be strong. Be strong. Not in Kratos. Be strong in the Lord. There's a sister. There's a voice speaking to your heart. He said, Be strong. Be strong. You can rise and be strong today. Silent. Melabon. Sakia later. Oh my God. Somebody rise upon your feet. I feel the anointing of the Holy Ghost. Sibo, Silata, Rekambo, Sila, Venakaite, Ebanda, Sufarate, Ebaleko, Bailasi, Rekebana, Tande, Miala, Tokabe. Can we pick in tongues for five minutes? Let's pick in tongues together. There's a protocol of strength. There's a protocol of strength. Kai bola kante kabo, sila tan kabo siya. Epa la te kabo se, vai te kande sima nate. Abrekato lataya zibabo, ebabo ebabo se, ebabo sila, ebabo lai te kabo, ebabande kaile. Abrekato la sai te kababa, me ya to kambe, mai tababo se vavali area so 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 tai aso tai la aso siya aso vai le. Aruate, my secavonate, a banda kaita baba bade, a brate kabon sase, a yako la tekayate, brate kabon sase ala, a banta katalezi, a brenta kabazilato, a baila socavane tai, menta kapapa, a teta tota te, a teta taila, menta kabala, zebra, a salota, maila kupapa. Can somebody cry? Said I do. There's a strength. I know you sense weakness at times. There's a strength that God can send. There's a strength. There's a strength. There's a strength. There's a strength. My Boba Batibo see. Rebaba sin is by the door. But there's a strength for you. A bomba say let our white. A pow wa pow wa pow wa pow. Wa pow pow pow. A pow wa pow pow pow. A bomba say a pow. Ah, le bore. A da da da. I can't see you praying. You don't want to throw the protocol of strength. Somebody cry, give ventilation to the Holy Ghost. Sin cannot have dominion over you. Apollo, la say la plata kaile. Aboba be aye na aye na kubalis kabe. Amen. 